what are chakras chakra is a sanskrit term that means wheels anything circular that goes on and on so you can imagine chakras like the rooms in your house so if you have a house uh, you don't live in a large unsegregated space we segregate it into spaces according to their function utility and probably times of the day where we use it so if you have a house you have a living space you have a dining room and then you have a study room so the rooms are split up according to the task uh, which you are going to be performing in that space so chakras are like that to the body uh, we have about seven chakras within the body and two outside of the body um, so chakras can be defined simply as multi-dimensional planes of energy um, that make us who we are uh, so we have the muladhara the root chakra right in the base of the spine the lowest part of the spine and then we have the swadhisthana followed by the manipuraha or the solar plexus right here which we often call the core and then we have the anahata or the heart space which comprises of the lungs and you know everything the heart and other things that are here and then we have the vishuddhi which is the throat chakra the chakra of expression and voice and just beautiful it's my favorite because i'm a singer as well and then we have the agnya which is the third eye the chakra the eye of intuition and inner wisdom followed by the topmost which is the crown chakra or the sahasrara the thousand petaled lotus chakra so these are the chakras in the body as i said they are the multi-dimensional planes of energy the various dimensions so what are these multi-dimensions you can see chakras as um, parts of your body like root chakra is com i mean comprises of your legs uh, the lower part of the body and then the other chakras likewise the manipura has the core the swadhisthana the hips and the lower abdomen so they can be looked at as physical dimensions or we can proceed further into the sheets of being in you guys they call the kosha which is then we go into the a more subtler sheet which is the breath it we can imagine our body as a body of breath actually which is more subtler than the physical dimension so the body of breath and then the body of mind or prana mind subtle waves or thinking then further further furthermore we go to the spirit body or the causal body so like this chakras are very interesting so for now i am have designed this routine for beginners as well as advanced practitioners who can perform it first thing in the morning we're going to be involving breath and very beautiful simple movements to warm up the chakras one by one from the muladhara till the sahasrara